Hey everybody, I'm Joel Strickland. Thanks for watching this week's Surviving Duck Season. Now, if you are a subscriber to our channel, you probably wonder, what happened to the video this week? We didn't post one. Well, I wanted to take a few minutes and just kind of share with you uh, some things that are kind of going on in my life, uh, completely aside from duck hunting. Um, back uh, earlier this week, I got a phone call from my dad. He said, I'm in the hospital, I broke my foot. Your mom is on an ambulance going from this hospital to another hospital because she had an episode and they checked her out and they said that her aorta was rupturing and they were gonna do an emergency surgery at a UAMS um, hospital in Little Rock. And so they rushed my mom there. I got up out of bed and put some clothes on and drove to Little Rock. It was a very stressful situation, as you can imagine. Uh, you know, never do you think that you're going to be in a situation where you are, you know, making decisions about your parents and, and their health and finding out that, that your parents are going to have surgery like something you would see on, you know, one of those television shows. I mean, you know, we're going to put your mom on, on a bypass machine for a while and cool her body down and, you know, pull her insides out and everything else. I mean, it's just, you know just something that you never want to you know have to deal with in life but you know fortunately uh, medicine is is in a, in a time where you know they can do some incredible things uh, my mom had her surgery it went well um, and then right now she's she's still um, recovering and that's been several days she hasn't woke up yet from the anesthesia and everything we're, we're just waiting for her to wake up and so Anyway, I just wanted to kind of share some of that with you. I wanted you to kind of know a little bit about what's going on in my life. Um, you know, I ask you to pray for, for us about that. Uh, we have all kinds of things that we're trying to deal with in, in regard to that with my dad's foot, you know, being broken and, and you know, being, being available to help my mom and, and all that once, you know, she's going to be released from the hospital. And then also, of course, praying that my mom will recover, you know, uh, very, very quickly and, and all that. And so, you know, again, we, we appreciate your prayers. You know, share this video with, with some people that you, you know, think would, would pray for us. We would really appreciate that. Uh, now, today was opening day of duck season in Arkansas, and uh, that's part of my livelihood. Me and my wife you know, work at a, at a lodge in Stuttgart during hunting season. It's a, you know, a big part of our, of our year. And, you know, when, when life gets interrupted with health issues and, things of that nature you know you have to deal with that and you have to you know also deal with making a living we're actually on our way back to Stuttgart uh, after going to town to, to see my mom and dad in, in the hospital and uh, we're going back to cook dinner for for everybody at the lodge tonight we had a, we had a good hunt this morning I took a group of guys out this morning um, and all of the groups you know that hunted with the lodge today did very well most people got you, go. you know close to their limit and, uh, lots of lots of ducks so that's that's really fun and uh we're going to be continuing you know bringing surviving duck season to you even though it's going to be a stressful life for us it's really going to be uh bring a new meaning to surviving duck season for for me and my family this year as we go through duck season because like i said it's not just the pastime for us it's part of our livelihood so i'm still going to be taking people duck hunting and cooking for folks at the lodge uh, as much as we can we're also going to be putting videos together for surviving duck season thanks so much for your support and uh, we really appreciate your prayers i know there's a lot of you out there that are praying folks and believe in the lord like we do so again thanks for that and uh by the way we're still doing the high and dry giveaway coming up so if you haven't seen that video, check out the video so you can get in on the, the chance of winning a pair of high and dry waders. I'll leave that uh, video link in the description. And uh, anyway, make sure you watch some of our other content. And until next time, good hunting and God bless.